Hey guys, this is just a very quick uh, update video on uh, on a previous video of mine. So uh, previously, I had a video called "Organize Your Videos on Your YouTube Channel in the Form of Playlists." And uh, what playlists do is uh, basically organize uh, the videos on your channel and uh, make make uh, your channel look like folders. So, for example, if uh, if this was my YouTube channel, uh, these would be uh, my playlists. So if I go ahead and click on one of those playlists. Uh, it will show all of my videos uh, contained inside of that playlist um, and that you're basically guessing that uh, helps me organize my stuff here so um, for example uh, if I have to go to my channel and uh, look for a video here I had to scroll down and down and more down and I still can't find the video just hit load more and uh, that makes things worse so basically uh, what playlists uh, does is uh, make it more organized so um, YouTube is uh, going to be uh, enforcing the new YouTube channel uh, interface from March the 1st and I got a video comment here saying uh, you might want to create a new video containing of the new YouTube layout so uh, that's what I'm doing so um, yeah so the new YouTube layout is kind of different from the current one and um, for someone like me who's uh, pretty much used to this it's kind of confusing but um, uh, what I'm do is I'm uh, just gonna click on the new channel design interface, uh, so that loads up my new channel. What I want to do is, uh, as you can see here, I have these three playlists. So if I go ahead and click everything 3ds Max, I don't want to click play all, just just a playlist here. What that does, it um, it acts as a folder, as I told you a million times by now. It contains all of my uh, tutorials on 3ds Max, my renders, and uh, all of that stuff. So if I go ahead and click one of the videos, I actually go ahead and watch that. And then this shows up, I can actually go ahead and go to my fourth video here and uh, play that back. So uh, the way to do this, uh, how you do this, is uh, basically you want to click on your name here and uh, you want to click on video manager. Uh, open that on a new tab, by the way. And um, okay, so let's say I want to add these uh, three. Um, uh, videos to my uh, to my playlist or to my folder. So what I'll do simply is to go ahead and take three videos, and then go inside of Add to, click that, and then I want to click Add to new playlist. Or if you already have a playlist, you can actually click on that. But uh, I'll just go ahead and add a new playlist, and I'm gonna name this uh, whoops uh, test playlist. Okay, and uh, make sure it's public, not private. Uh, if it's private, only select people can view it. So make sure it's public, and then hit create playlist here. And what that does is this nifty little box uh, opens up here and uh, shows the three videos that you just added. Now, how to um, uh, make them visible in your new channel? So you can actually go ahead and uh, change the order of them as well. I'm just gonna go ahead with this one. And uh, to add them to your new channel, you first have to go to your channel. So you want to click on your name here, and you want to click on my channel. That's going to take you to your new channel. And possibly the uh, new interface is going to be enforced to you by now. So um, what you want to do simply is uh, where you see all of these featured playlists, you want to just hit edit here. Uh, and by the way, if you don't see it, uh, you just want to hit edit channel here on the very top. And uh, you want to go inside of a feature tab and change the uh, lookout so currently I have it set to creator uh, you can actually go ahead and hit blogger and what that does it um, it shows your videos here and your playlists here okay and you can actually go ahead inside of everything and uh, it shows you everything basically uh, I don't think it's visible inside of network network here but um, yeah uh, I'm just gonna stick with creator and then I'm gonna hit done editing. All right, so now um, you'll have these visible. So um, the test playlist is here by default, but um, what if it doesn't show up? You just wanna hit edit next to featured playlists, and I'm just gonna delete all of these videos from here, and then hit apply. And it's gonna refresh the page, and uh, it's not gonna be there. You just wanna hit add playlist here, and you can actually change the name here from featured playlists to uh, you know my playlists I guess and then you wanna hit add playlists to add select playlists to add and you wanna select the test playlist that you just created 
um, these are the standard like uh, playlists that are created by default uh, these contain all of my uploaded videos and these contain all of my favorited videos so uh, I'm just gonna add uh, like four of them uh, random four of them and then hit add selected and then hit apply here it's gonna refresh the page and as you can see uh, you can see those uh, those videos here so um, uh, let's say I want to had go inside of test playlist and I can actually go ahead and uh, play this up so yeah uh, that's how you do it on the new YouTube layout um, let's see. Uh, yeah so this is it uh, thanks to the Megatron bomb for uh, for the suggestion so yeah thanks for watching guys if you like the video if this helped you out please go ahead and sub me uh, add me as a friend or whatever so yeah thanks for watching uh, please comment like and subscribe Okay, so one thing I may have forgot in the main video, uh, you can actually change the order of these playlists as well. You can just hit edit here and uh, see these little three lines here. Uh, selecting that, you can actually change the order in which your playlists show up. So I'm just going to close here and uh, you can do it uh, pretty much um, any order you want to. So I'm just going to give it any random order. Maybe this one goes here. Uh, here. And uh, yeah, basically. So, yeah, this is pretty much it now, so uh, thanks for watching.